Sergeant Kina here reporting for duty, and last we left off in Cosmic Heroin, or Cosmic Star Heroin, uh, we defeated the monster. However, we've learned that the robots in this facility can reanimate the dead, so the dead monster has been reanimated once again and is alive and well, and more than likely stronger than before, so it's probably gonna show us a thing or two. Alright, well, there's the ventilation shafts we came through, so that's great. That's, uh, terminals busted. What? Wait, what's this? Find something interesting? I'm seeing a lot of references for something called the Project Lumia. These files are really corrupt. Looks like it might have, have something to do with the brain augmentation. But I can't find anything. I can't find any details. If it led to what we see around us, it couldn't. It can't have been good. Yeah, probably, you know, brain augmentation makes sense. You know, robots going in the brain. Ah, oh, fucking goddamn robots everywhere. One some more. Alright, so... This thing is still weak to stuff. I'm just gonna go with a normal bash since I, I'll wait until I have uh, the hyper to do that water damage. Or the water move, per se, not particularly damage. Uh, let's do a focus, and then we're gonna do... Um, a pyro and then uh, an echo of the last attack. I want to see if I do that whether or not it's going to mimic the focused pyro. Because if it did that, that would be super dope. Alright, so I already focused, so we're going to do a purification torch. Alright, that did like not as much damage as I thought it was going to do, but you know. Oh! Okay, I thought she was going to get attacked again. I was going to be sad. I was like, dude, no. It's not what I want at all. Uh, first aid myself. Please. And he has that going on, so maybe... Uh, There's not really much. I mean, I guess I could void bullet one of them. They're all kind of low HP, so I don't think it really matters. Now, let's see if this is working. Ah, damn. It didn't work like I thought it was going to do. I thought it would imitate the focus, which would have made that, like, an insanely strong ability. But it's still nice that it's still, you know, it still does what, you know, a decent amount. It's not perfect, but it's still really cool. Because it allows us to use our, our stronger abilities more than once in a row. Or it allows us to use it in a row. I get, oh, chest. Chest, chest, chest. Let's grab that before we go up there. Yes, gimme. Found 80 credits. Feels good. Alright, up, up, up. Now I know we're gonna be running into that dude soon. I know it. It's gonna be like right here, probably. It's gonna be just in the middle, once again. Uh, this must be the inner sanctum. Finally, this better be worth the effort. Wait. We're being watched. Oh, I knew it. Big ol' freaking robot beast. Oh yeah, there it is. Oh, he's mad. He's got three eyeballs now, too. He was wild. That's a lot bigger than before. Ah! We're going to die. We're going to die. We're going to die. Pull it together. We're not going to die. Not here. Move into formation. Yeah. Formation. Alright. 2000 HP. I mean, part beast, part machine. Prepare for a long battle. A long battle? Oh, shit. He better not have healing capabilities. Alright. Just, uh, you know, 23 damage. Feels good, man. Feels good. Big damages. Uh, can we poison this guy? He's part beast. Oh, we can. Great. Um, and then... Defense, 25% for the party. Uh, doesn't it buff? Reduces damage taken. I want to use it on her, because I feel like she's probably going to get hit the most. Yeah, I thought so. Alright. Hit him with the water. And we're going to go with... Uh, we're going to see if we can stun him. Okay, we can. Alright, alright. Uh, she's not on Hyper yet. She will next turn, though. Uh, Gunamancy, curse, 
curses and resistance up. I don't think he's going to throw up any curses at us. So I don't think I really have to worry about that. Uh, just to go with the normal pistol shot. And... A normal staff shot. Maybe we can stun him too. That would have been great if we could have stunned him there. Oh, I should have void bolted him there. That would have done way more damage. Way more damage. Uh, purification torch. Oh, he's gonna die. He's gonna die for sure. But I really should have saved. I should have saved his uh, his hyper for the for the void bolt. It would have been way better. Um, I, I mean, nobody really needs heals yet. Can environmental hack this guy? I think it will stun him again. Yeah, stun. Heal blaster. I mean, I guess. We can heal her up a little bit. That's actually way strong. Laser. 222 damage. That's uh, pretty strong. We'll style ourselves up. We'll just go with a regular pistol shot. And then I'm assuming the Void Bolt will be able to... No! It's still a little bit of far away for the Void Bolt being able to kill him. But it's still going to do like a lot of damage. Yeah, 450. Pretty, pretty good, I'd say, myself. Pretty good. Flicks of vulnerable. Um, didn't I, I... I need to echo. I need to echo. Oh, did I... I thought I, uh... I thought I healed last turn. And healed her. Did I not? No! It won't let me go back. Well, fuck. If he attacks Alyssa, she's going down. Oh, that was, um, that was a close one, you could say. Definitely a close one. Alright, uh, let's just go with the rest here. And... Me yeah, up, I don't really have, like, anything good. To do damage. I, it just has to be a normal pistol shot. It feels bad. Whew. Um... Barely, dude. They barely survived that one. 120 XP, 150 credits. Yeah, see, look at it. We made it. Uh, knockout, weak physical attacks that also may inflict stun or vulnerability. Hmm. No new abilities. System crash, deals damage. Uh, may inflict rust on robotic enemies. Cool. Cool. I like that. You got a beast shield. Whew. We did it. We did it. No way that monster is coming back from that. Now let's find out what's so important here. All right, yeah, uh, assuming, you know, we go over to the big computer. Well, let's see what this baby has inside. Jackpot, what did you find? Thousands of unencorrupted files detailing their research here. It's gonna take a while to dig through all of this. Download everything. We'll turn it back into the agency for when we get back for analysis. Will do. All right, is that everything we, uh, we have? Uh... I mean, I guess we could just exit now, right? There's not really any other examinations we can do, right? Or any other thing with bombs? Doesn't look like it. Guess we'll just walk ourselves out of here then. Uh, no, let's not leave any. What? What are you? We're not leaving anything behind. If I can download them, bro. What am I missing here? No. Oh, right there. Take. Got a strange device. I'm assuming now that's everything, right? No, it is not. Maybe we use the strange device on the uh, computer? Nope. Maybe up here? Take. Oh. What's this? You got another strange device. Is there any more strange? I'm assu assuming there's probably one more strange device, but maybe not. We pick this up, uh, that, uh, or that thing up there up. Uh, I don't see anything else lying around. Those are probably like little nano, you know, brain configuration. I think that's everything. Mike, we'll be out on the surface over by the target in 10 minutes, requesting evacuation. Copy that, over and out. <laughs> Alright. You know, uh, strange thing. So who's this dude? Arte, it's not here. I was too late. They blew past all obstacles, the API is training its agents well these days. And now they have the device in their possession. This is bad. 
A minor setback, if it's a setback at all, given a few years. No, waiting is unacceptable. My time is finite. I can't get the device myself, but what if... Yes, this could work. The strange devices you found in the lab have been transferred to the secure API storage facility for analysts. Good job, everybody. It's really late. I'll see you tomorrow. Later. Good night. Time to call it a day. Looks like I can't sleep at all. Well, or maybe I can. Maybe they tried to abduct me. What do I have on my head? Am I having a nightmare? Have I been abducted? That's a lot of people. That doesn't look good at all. Whoa, whoa, whoa! That's the director. The fuck was that? That was the director, and like some freaking giant to control other people with his mind device. Ah! That dream, it felt so real. You heard tapping on the door. Psst! Alyssa! Get up! We need to talk to you! Alright. Wow, she undressed extremely fast. Oh, look at this double monitor set up with freaking, you know, oh, she, what is that, on the TV? And what is that, a PlayStation? Oh, this seems like a pretty sweet setup. No new emails. I've never seemed to finish any of my RPGs I buy, maybe on my next vacation. You know what? I can really uh, relate to that. I have so many RPGs in my Steam games st uh, folder or what, storage or whatever the hell you call it, um, games that I own. And, uh, I probably played a couple hours of each of them and haven't gone very far. Feels bad, man. Feels bad. Yeah, you wouldn't believe how hard it is to wake someone up quietly. You need to see what we found. Dave, have you been hacking into places you're not supposed to be in? Actually, this was Sector Chief Sue's insistence. He told me that he had a bad feeling about this mission and wanted me to look into it. And look into it, I did. And boy, did I hit pay dirt. Listen to this transmission from Director Steele I found. Aha, uh -huh, see, fucking he's director, director Steele's going fucking into the dark side, my dude. Those, oh god, I can't remember what I gave this guy's name. Um, those fools from Australia don't even, that's not what I gave. What did I give, give him his voice? I'm gonna have to listen to what I gave him, dude. This, the guy's voice was great. All right, now I know what his voice is. Those fools from Australia don't even realize the magnitude of what they discovered. Just another old research station, hardly. I've dispatched some of our best agents to the site to secure the device, and of course, you'll be nearly you'll be nearby to clean up the mess if they fail. The Lumina project has the potential to heal the wounded mind. No longer will humanity struggle against itself. The, taba the, tabo the taboos that bind us will be shattered. The agency of peace and intelligence will finally fulfill its name. Humanity will rule over all. The taboos that bind us? What could he mean? He must be referring to the Mental Automity Act. No technology will may be made that infringes on individuals' right of freedom of thought. The War of Cybernetic Insanity a traditional computer virus might ruin a machine, but when the machine in question is directly hooked up to the human brain... I've heard stories of those days. The lucky ones went straight into a coma, but most went feeding into a feeding frenzy, killing family and friends without thought. Trapped in your own body, fate worse than death. Thankfully, the technology was still new, and it had only been accepted by a small percentage of the population, or that would have been the end. How awful! Every piece of data that I've dug up on this Project Lumi, as he's talking about, fills me with dread. It's much more advanced than the old technology. While the old side epidemic technology was open to tampering, Project Lumia offers more direct control. Mind control? Exactly. Total control of another's mind. I don't know what Steel's endgame is, but it can be good. No. No, this is unacceptable! We can't let this happen. What are you saying? 
I thought the agency had humanity's best interests in mind. And maybe they did at one point, but the point but that point is in the past. No one should wield such ultimate power, especially someone who would use it to dominate others over others. And since we're the ones who brought the technology here, it's up to us to deal with it. Music to my ears! Dave, can you remove the relevant files from the API server? No. As soon as I get, as those files go up, multiple backups are made. They'll duplicate the information faster than I can delete it. However, the information in those files is fragmented and poorly organized. Without proper physical prototype, without the physical prototype, it could take them a whole while to make progress. You're not seriously thinking? Yes. Let's steal the vices back. I'm on it. Looks like the place has been in Vault 348, moderate security. There's a scheduled analyst in a few hours. We don't have much time. We need to break in, steal the Project Lumia prototypes, get out, and then figure out some way to counter this technology. If we do this, there's no turning back. We'll be branded as traitors by the agency. I'm in. Chan, you can count on me! The exit on the south end of the main floor leads to the vaults. I'll upload some false data to the server to try to divert as much security as possible. We can do this, let's go! You know, something really strikes me odd here. Um, so, or, uh, one of the uh, the chief Sue, I think it was is the is the chief the chief Sue said to look into Director Steel. Like he doesn't feel right about it. So the chief himself said, look into Director Steel. I don't feel right about it unless he no, it's not the chief and the director's the chief and I misunderstood. But he's saying that in a way like I don't trust him. I feel like he's doing something wrong with our with the information that we we got. And it seems like Director Steel is the one who's effing us over. And that he's the bad guy and not everyone's the bad guy. You know, you know what I'm seeing here? It seems like Sue is the good guy, which I, I thought was the chief, but I made the director's the chief. I thought the director and chief were two different things. Maybe I was wrong and the director is the chief, but I feel like I feel like it's well, we shouldn't be going rogue. We should like inform Sue, we should do like internal investigation, we should take down Director Steel. You know, this is the, this is what I would do, you know. <laughs> Alright, I feel like that is the correct thing that uh, I would have done. Anyways, let's go over here and see if there's any upgrades uh, before going along and ending episode for today. Uh, let's see here. Uh, bye. You got anything good? Nope. It's the same stuff as before. So, I think we're going to go ahead and end the episode here today, and I'll see you guys next time with many more star, uh, Cosmic Star heroine to come. I'm Sergeant Kenai, and I'm signing out.